Trinity B1 ISC1 Four Skills Test CELT Secure English Language Tests B1 English Test ISC1 Skilled Worker Health and Care Worker Scale-Up Worker Student Visas First of all, uh, do you know about the pattern of the test? Do you know what is the pattern of the test? Yeah, I know. What is the pattern of the test? Could you tell me? It's three type, uh, four type of reading, listening, writing, mm -hmm. and speaking. What, what is the time of the test? Like, what is the total time for uh, speaking and listening according to you? Uh, I, uh, around 45 minutes. Speaking and listening is only for 18 minutes, okay? Six minutes 18. for speaking and 10 to 11 minutes for listening. That's okay. it. Finish. Finish, okay? Yes. Very okay. small test. Very small speaking and listening test. Reading okay. and writing is also for like... 20 minutes? Two hours. Two reading hours. and writing together for two hours yeah a reading writing is for two hours okay yeah, and yeah. first i want to decide your speaking topic with you uh have you seen any videos on youtube oh. yes uh what topic would you like to choose for yourself i shall be working and which topic do you want to choose for your speaking Hobbies, my family, traveling, myself. What topic would you like to choose? My myself? Uh, <laughs> I think you should choose some easy topic because my family could be hard for you. Okay, let's do it. Let's go with my family. Why don't you try my hobbies? Sorry? Why don't you try the topic, my hobbies? I like my family, that's right. Okay, let's choose them. My family. First point. First topic point. Which one, my family one? Yes. What's first topic point? I don't know how to select this topic. Okay then. Okay, so we're going to go with the topic myself. Okay. And first topic point, my family. <clears throat> Se second topic point, my favorite food. Do you like music or watching TV? Watching TV. Okay, my favorite TV program. Or if you don't like that, we can even go with uh, my best friend. Do you have any best friend? Yes. Okay, my best friend, you can go with my favorite shopping center or my favorite place. Shopping center. My favorite shopping center. My favorite shopping. Okay. okay. If you want to change the point, my best friend, and write instead of it, my favorite TV program, that is still your choice. Right? If you want to write my favorite TV program or my favorite music or my country, which point do you like? In my country. Can you take a picture of this? Then I will teach you how to do the speaking test. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. I want you to take a photo of this. Take it. Okay, keep yeah. this screenshot with you because this is your final topic. Now I'm going to do a six minute speaking test with you, Paris. Okay. Six minute speaking test. Paris, jahan se aapko samaj nahi aayegi, aap mujhe Hindi mein puchiyega, main aapko bataungi. Kyunki test ke baare mein confusion nahi honi chahiye. Thik hai? Aapko okay. sara samaj aani chahiye ki kya hai. Thik hai? Okay. Ek dafa Hindi okay. mein bata deti hu. Test bahut asaan hai. Reading, okay. writing, do ghante ki saath mein integrated. Speaking and listening, 18 minutes ki saath mein, thik hai? Okay. Jis mein speaking 6 minute ki hoti hai, aur baki time agar 10 se 11 minute jo hote hai, wo listening ke liye hote hai. 
ओके पैरिस लिखने पे ध्यान मत दीजिएगा मेरी बात को समझने की कोशिश कीजिएगा अभी इस लेक्चर में मैं आपको सब कुछ जो स्पीकिंग के बारे स्पीकिंग और लिसनिंग के बारे में आपको जानना चाहिए वो मैं आपको बता रही हूँ और आपको टॉपिक भी चूज कर लिया है आपने अब हम एक टेस्ट करेंगे ठीक है लेकिन नोट अब आई आई डोंट नो हाउ टू या दैट्स फाइन स्पेलिंग I understand that, but right now the first thing is that is very important that you get a clear concept of the exam. Okay, that we have integrated skills in English speaking, listening for eighteen minutes and for two hours reading and writing. Okay, okay. Uh, today in this lecture, uh, we are going to prepare everything about speaking and listening first. Yeah. Okay. Start. This is Trinity College London, ISC one B one. My name is Angelina. What's your full name? Paras Gundalia. What's your topic's title for today? Myself. What are your four topic points? My family, my uh, favorite shopping center, my country, and my favorite food. Good job. What kind of food do you like to eat? I like to I like uh, pizza. Mm. How often do you eat pizza? Sorry. How often do you eat pizza? Often means I don't know. Often how means. often means how many times? Once in a week, twice in a week, sometimes, every day. Yes. How often do you Not eat pizza? Not every day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we uh. Two two three times, one week. Twice or thrice in a week. Twice or thrice in a week. week. Okay, that that's nice. Uh, tell me something about your country. Do you have any famous places in your country? Yes. Can you tell me what are those? Sorry. Could you tell me what are the famous places in your country? Yes, Surat is famous in my country. I like oh. Surat city. Mm. What is it famous for? There are too much business like a diamond, like textile. It's very famous. Mm. That's very nice. That's very good. And how's the weather in your country? Sorry. How's the weather in your country? How's the weather in your country? This weather is good. Sometimes cold, sometimes hot. Ah, oh, that's good. That's good. Um, tell me something about your favorite shopping center. Where is it? My favorite shopping center in Surat, the VR Mall, like his biggest mall. Uh, shop, cloth shop, and music shop, and food shop. Mm. Okay, how do you travel to your favorite shopping center? Go to by car, by bike. Sometimes oh. car, sometimes bike. Oh, that's really nice. That's very good. Um, what did you buy from your favorite shopping center recently? Recently, I buy cloth. What kind of clothes did you buy? I like jeans, t-shirts, and shoes. That's nice. That's nice. Okay. Um, could you tell me something about your family? Yes, my family is small family. And I live with my family, mother and my father and my wife, all together live. What are your favorite family activities? I like uh, all family going together, picnic and traveling. I like this one. Mm. Right, this is the end of part one and you've passed in part one. Congratulations. Now we're going Thank to move you. to part two. I'm going to select a topic of my choice. And the topic that I've chosen for you is rules at your work. What are the rules at your work? Yes. 
what yeah. are the rules rules at your work rules this is the topic okay. of my choice okay when i first i go in in my work there i'm check everything is okay like a uh, temperature sheet like a uh, uh, inside the weather because my restaurant is too much hot because there my make pizza and after i check uh, all the uh, vegetables is good is expired date check and after i start work and first i went go there i wash my hand hand wash and clean my hand because is food hygiene is uh, matter in the restaurant and after i check temperature sheet and write down all temperature fridge all fridge temperature and then after start my work when order come there i first check this order is veg non veg after i make uh, like a veg and non veg and every time i check up the temperature inside the oven and check uh, food quality is good you know and and check my cloth is very good after uh, i change my cloth in compulsory wearing the black pant and black shirt all right that's very nice are there any rules at your work that you want to change yes yeah, some sometime restaurant very busy that time some my rules uh, make a quickly and uh, make by a properly step by step that's why uh, quickly go order going will try every time i make properly food because sometimes some customer thinking this one not make good pizza and not make good quality sometimes okay. i change this one why do you think rules are important because rules not important after a uh, restaurant review bed and sometime food hygiene coming that's why rating um, very bad and some customer coming he see everything he will not follow some customer uh give a bad bad comment after the restaurant effect rules are important for why do you think Sorry? rules are important rules are important for what reason this reason is uh business grow and rules not properly follow the business is uh, so business down after not a grow up business rules are important for discipline at work rules are important yeah. for peaceful environment at work paris listen yes. rules are yeah. important for uh no fights at work rules are important yeah. for customer satisfaction okay tell me again why do you think rules are important is customer not uh, good thing and no fight bahut ha no fights customer no satisfaction fight. ye writing ke liye bhi question bahut important hai you have to learn these points if you want i can send these points to you on whatsapp just okay. a minute why do you think rules are important at work rules are important at work for customer satisfaction for business success for yeah. peaceful environment at work <clears throat> for discipline yeah and so for completing five. project on time okay for doing work properly I sent you this, okay? Okay. Very important topic, even for writing. Very, very important. Okay. okay. Now it's time for listening. Now get a paper and a pen for yourself, and I will be playing two recordings for you. Okay. Have you tried any recordings before? No. 
I'm going to play a recording twice about mangoes. I would want okay. you to listen to the recording twice and then I'd, I'd ask you to tell me. Apologies. Then I would want you to answer six questions that I will ask you. Okay. ISC 1, task 1. Morning, everyone. I expect all of you like eating fruit. And today we're going to talk about one of my favorite fruits. And that's the mango. In some parts of the world, it is even called the king of fruits. It's surprising to know that mango trees can grow up to 40 meters high. I thought they were much shorter. Mangoes take up to six months to become ripe, so be patient. About half of the world's mangoes grow in India, but India exports very few of the world's mangoes. This is because Indian people eat most of their mangoes. I'm not surprised. People say if you give someone a basket of mangoes, it is a sign of friendship. Isn't that nice? Now, let's try some of the delicious mangoes we have here today and see if you like them. Now listen again. Morning, everyone. I expect all of you like eating fruit. And today we're going to talk about one of my favorite fruits. And that's the mango. In some parts of the world, it is even called the king of fruits. It's surprising to know that mango trees can grow up to 40 meters high. I thought they were much shorter. Mangoes take up to six months to become ripe, so be patient. About half of the world's mangoes grow in India, but India exports very few of the world's mangoes. This is because Indian people eat most of their mangoes. I'm not surprised. People say if you give someone a basket of mangoes, it is a sign of friendship. Isn't that nice? Now let's try some of the delicious mangoes we have here today and see if you like them. Now I'll ask you six questions about mangoes. Are you ready? Okay. All right. Now, could you please tell me what is the mango called in some parts of the world? Is a uh, king of fruit. That is right. How high can mango trees grow? Right, uh, 40 meters. That is correct. How long do mangoes take to become ripe? Six months. How many of the world's mangoes grow in India? Uh, sorry, sorry, repeat. How many of the world's mangoes grow in India? Six months. How many Hello? of the world's... Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, no, about half. Why does India export so few of their mangoes? It's uh, something sign. No, oh, because Indian Indian people eat their man eat most of the mangoes. What does it mean yeah, if you give someone a basket of mangoes? What does it mean if you give someone a basket of mangoes? The sign of friendship. You have passed by the yeah, way. You sign, get, sign yeah, and friendship. Yeah. You gave me four correct answers. Now we're going to move to part two. I am going to play a recording for you, and I would want you to listen to it and do not take any notes, right? No notes. Only listen, yeah? Only listen, and then I will ask you to tell me in few words what is this recording about. I'm going to play the recording about Fiji. Listen carefully, and then tell me in few words what is this recording about. ISC 1, task 2. Good morning, everyone. In today's class, I want to tell you about a country called Fiji. So, there are 333 small islands in Fiji. It has a population of just under 1 million people. And most people live on the coast. Now, what about the language? Well, there are three main languages, but almost everyone can speak English. And how do the local people make a living? Well, tourism is the most important activity. People love the beaches because they're quiet. Most of the tourists come from Australia. If you go to Fiji, you'll find that many food dishes include fish, and the national drink comes from the pepper plant. Finally, if you like sport, the most popular sport is rugby. 
but recently more people have started playing football. Now let's watch a film about this country. Yes, could you please tell me in few words what is this recording about? Country in three languages, but mm. all people speak like English and mm. 340 around Iceland. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Good, good. Thank you. Yeah. Now listen again and take your notes. You can take your notes now. Yeah. 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 Take your notes. And now I'll play the recording once again. Once the recording will end, I would want you to tell me six facts about the recording. Let's listen. ISC 1, task 2. Good morning, everyone. In today's class, I want to tell you about a country called Fiji. So, there are 333 small islands in Fiji. It has a population of just under 1 million people and most people live on the coast. Now, what about the language? Well, there are three main languages, but almost everyone can speak English. And how do the local people make a living? Well, tourism is the most important activity. People love the beaches because they're quiet. Most of the tourists come from Australia. If you go to Fiji, you'll find that many food dishes include fish, and the national drink comes from the pepper plant. Finally, if you like sport, the most popular sport is rugby. But recently, more people have started playing football. Now, let's watch a film about this country. Yes, could you please tell me? Six facts about the recording. Sorry, hello? Yes, could you tell me six facts about the recording? Yeah, is there a, a 300, uh, 330 uh, um, beach? Okay. Mm -hmm. Then one million people live there and too much people visit there because this uh, this area is very quiet. Mm -hmm. And and there are three main languages, but most mm -hmm. of people using English language. Mm -hmm. And too much tourist uh, tourism going there. Mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. Most of people in Australian. Mm -hmm. And there are uh, famous. Uh, most of people like the um, mm -hmm. game, like the mm -hmm. game. Uh, sport like the sport is push, uh, football is men playing all people. That's nice. They're famous and uh, their food is pepper plant food something pepper plant mm -hmm. is famous there. That's very nice. And, uh, all people watching film. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Very nice, sir. Could you ask me, uh, could you tell me how many islands are there in Fiji? There are 333 around. Congratulations, you passed your listening with a distinction. Good job. Thank you.